Let's go. Seven days to die. TBF Gaming jumping back into War of the Walkers. Exciting to get going today. It's day 28. I can't believe it's Horror Day, whether it's a server or single player. Anytime I log in for a Horror Day, I'm surprised that it's already a Horror Day, which means we completely mismanaged our last six days, and now we're going to pay for it on Horde Night. The Horde base is pretty much ready to go. We just got to do some upgrades and some fortification around the thing, and we're going to add a bunch of barbed wire. So let's get barbed wire made. That's a big thing right now. So barbed wire action first. We also have a bunch of supplies that we went out and got just now. We did a whole bunch of mining, and then we killed a couple wandering hordes, but we got ourselves a whole bunch. Let's, let's sort it real quick. We got a whole bunch of clay. I already put the iron that we did downstairs be below a little bit ago. Put that in there. And we'll probably let's do a, just a couple quick drop-offs, and then I'll just throw the rest in a drop box, and we'll get it all sorted out another day. Uh, I think it's this one is usually a good drop box. And you know what? We're going to use... Any of these skill points, let's go ahead and use those, these two, I think that's it, and that one, there you go, we're going to use all these, we're currently level 139, we're flying through the levels, and we're going to hopefully hit 150 today or tomorrow, I'm hoping we're going to hit there, currently we're game stage 199, loot stage 223 in the area that we're in, and then we're 1747 kills, getting close to that 2000 kills, and somehow no player kills and no deaths, how have we survived 28 days? I have no idea. You guys know day 29, we up the difficulty to the next difficulty. That should be a lot of fun and a lot of disaster, but I'm excited to get there. Let's go ahead and do all these skill points real quick. Skill point times two. We're going to save most of these skill points, though, until we get to level 150, because that's the next big unlock. So we're going to just use all these just to go ahead and get them read up and get them out of my inventory. Boom. There you go. Level 140. All right. And there's another experience card. Here's a reward point card. Three skill points. Oh, we're going to have so many skill points after this. This is going to be awesome. Another three skill points there. So currently, skill point-wise, 43 beautiful skill points. We're doing good on the action skills. We've been flying through all those. There are a few of them that we need to start doing. I, like, I need to go fist some zombies. We need to... Hold on. We need to go punch some zombies. Let's not do the first thing. And then we also need to look through some of these things that we could upgrade now. But like I said, I want to save most of these for later. Although, oh, no, I lied. I want this now. Oil pump. Yeah. And we don't we haven't really needed a lot of oil, but it'll definitely help out. A fishing pole. You get a line, I get a pole. There we go. Okay, I've not really messed with those before. Uh, tools, weapons, weapons. I haven't had to make any weapons because we're doing so good on getting lucky and finding stuff. We really haven't had to mess with it too much. So we'll just kind of ignore that for now. Buildables, dynamite mines, grenades, no. Power turrets, we'll definitely want when we get to 150. Wood nails. We're still waiting on forge steel, which is also 150. That's the big one. And I think that's it. Light recipes. Wind surfer. I guess we'll learn it. We're not really going to make it just yet. And then iron armor. Boom. All right, next one. And reusables. We don't really need many of these either. We've gotten the big ones that we've needed as we've gone. But let's do the tier food. Tier 3 food. Let's do bread. Let's do beverages tier three. Those are all big unlocks. And alcoholic beverages. It is the end of the world. Might as well have a little bit of liquor. And fertilized seeds. And water blocks. Really? Oh. Craft pipe blocks and water blocks. Oh, you can use them for... Oh, my God. This has the water thing just like Darkness Falls where you can put some water down to water the crops. We've got to get some crops going. I didn't expect on living this long. So it's a lot of times... We don't create a farm because I don't think we're going to live that long. And somehow we've lived lo way longer than I thought we would. All right, let's go. I do want to put the dart traps if we can today, if we have time. But that's not a huge, huge must-do today. Let's put all these up. Keep that. Keep the green tea. There you go. We'll come back for ammo and rounds. Let's go ahead and get most of the upgrade stuff together. Let's go ahead and get all of our cement. Boom. Let's get a lot of our... Do we use regular iron? I don't think we do, but let, just in case we'll grab iron. Let's grab cobblestone, if I can figure out where I put it. Cobblestone. Then we need to go ahead and make barbed wire. So let's go barbed, barbed wire trap. These things were pretty incredible last time, so I want to make a crazy amount of them. Wait, let me double check that I didn't already do that. Barbed wire... The problem is it's really hard to see, so I'm probably missing if it is there, but I don't see it up here. Okay, we're good. We're good. We'll roll on without that. We did go ahead and put some stuff over here inside of these because we just had so much junk. We went ahead and threw a bunch of the stuff into this one here for all the tools and weapons, and we did 
find out that we have a legendary fire axe. So we went ahead and equipped the legendary fire axe. We also changed out our impact driver to be a little bit better one. Nothing else was changed. Everything else is just kind of inside of there. I was looking, though. I think we can do one more robotic sledge. All right. I think we can keep making... Which one's the stone one here? Let's make a little bit more cement. All right. We'll go one, two, three, four. Boom. There you go. We'll get a whole bunch more of that made up. And then we'll throw the sand. Uh-oh. What did I do with it? Cement. Hold on. Did I not grab it? Oh, there it is. I just didn't see it. All right. Cement there. Let's see if we can make a little bit more concrete mix. I can make 727 more. Boom. Okay. That's not too bad. Just as long as we have a little bit of that going, we should be good to go. Let's go ahead and go do some upgrades. And then we'll start putting down... Oh, where are they? Hold on. Did I not? Barbed wire trap. Okay. It... Oh, they're right there. I just couldn't see them. Oh, weird. Okay, cool. We got a bunch of those barbed wire traps. Let's go put these down. We're also going to bring over our other two gunmen over here, or three of you. You're going to go over to the base place. But what we, we want to do, we saw it in the comments. Someone said that they kind of outfitted this castle to have these guys with the guns all around it. So I'm going to build little platforms on the edge here, and we're going to move the shooters all around here so that they're just always shooting people. But let's finish out this first. I need to go ahead and put in a frame down here. Also, I forgot the wooden nails. My bad. So we need... Oh, God, I didn't grab wood or wooden nails. But we need to fix all those little holes that are there. And that's kind of the only drawback is when they go underneath, they do a lot of hitting on the bridge underneath. So I need to check down there as well. But it's kind of, kind of a weird build spot. It was such a weird place to take over as a horde base. But it's worked out really well. All right. We need wood and wood nails. So let's go... Let's go like this. We'll just grab half a stack of wood. And then I assume wood nails is up here. I got 375. I don't know if that's going to be enough or not. We'll see how much it takes per upgrade. Sorry, I thought I saw a spider out there. We've been pretty good. It's actually been quiet in terms of wandering hordes. We haven't had too much come over here and give us trouble. All right. As I say that, we're going to get attacked. But let's get the upgrades going. So first thing here. And then we want all of this concrete, at least the bottom couple rows. There we go. We also learned that they will walk up these, so that's not a good thing. We've got to watch out for that. All right. Oh, wow. They, yeah, they wrecked that right there. Let's go ahead and put another one in here. Come on. Upgrade that. Upgrade that. There you go. Definitely upgrade these ones. At least the first couple rows. go looking good across there and like i said i want to widen this out just a little bit because I'm, I'm afraid they're going to break this down with just one step per instead of playing the cuper game we'll put a couple steps here all right definitely break that all right and they were definitely breaking on that one there you go there we go very nice okay cool that takes care of that really not as many upgrades as i thought it would be but these ones as well. Okay. Guess we'll do those ones. I guess we'll just do the whole thing to concrete. Plus, it gives us good XP anyway. We're already level 141. Awesome. And this gave us a little bit of problem last time. They tried to go across that instead, so we'll have to keep an eye on that. That's still going to be a thing. All right, let's upgrade these ones. Upgrade this. There you go. Yeah, and they started, from what I remember, they were coming up here, weren't they? Yeah, they broke into this a little bit. They didn't really damage right there. They tried to. I don't know. We'll figure out how to do that. We might just knock this out. We could do that. So that way they're not trying to do that anymore. Break this one, too. Just to be sure. There you go. And then if we wanted to just make sure that it's still fortified, we can always do this. There you go. Just just to make sure. I just don't want it... I don't know what the stability looks like up there. Hopefully it's good now. 
There you go. Much, much better. We'll do the same thing on this side. Yeah, because they definitely broke into that one just a little bit. Break this one out. There you go. That'll hopefully stop them from messing with that. Got it. And then upgrade these guys. Perfect. Got it. And they didn't climb up that at all, so we're good there. That's the one we want to break out again. Yeah, I should have broke that one out instead of upgrading it. My bad. Quickly knock it down. And we'll throw these in. There you go. Just kind of watching how this whole thing is morphing. This is kind of cool. All right, let me check below. I want to see what they were doing down below. I know they were down here banging and clanging in a few spots. Oh, oh. They've respawned down here. What's up, lady? Is it just you? Nope. There's something else. Oh, there's a broken thing back there. Look at that. Was it just you? Nope, we got two. There we go. <laughs> nice. This is a nice little hiding spot. At level 142. Awesome. We've got so many skill points to spend. Okay, cool. So, yeah, it looks like they, they banged a little bit down here, but it's not too bad. I'm more so just as long as they don't bang these out, I think we'll be all right. There you go. Yeah, they, they banged and clanged on a few things, but nothing really, really bad. All right, now, that's really close. We're going to have to go get that in just a minute. Let's go ahead and start putting down a just mountain load of these barbed wires. Or, actually, let's do our... Let's do our widening of the path first. So first thing first, let's widen the path just a little bit. At least up to a certain point, and then that way they can make their way up. So we'll go... Should we go three wide or two wide? I think we go two wide. So let's go like this. And we'll, we'll put things all the way down too, but at least up to right there. Go too wide. There you go. And then we'll widen out the entrance. To basically be the exact same thing, just a little wider. And I guess that's it. We need to break out that if we want to go there. And then this guy. Can I not put this down there? There we go. All right, cool. And then upgrade these guys. Yeah, we'll take these all the way to concrete. There we go. It just kind of, that way they don't, when they start breaking down one of these little steps, they'll still be able to make their way up a little bit. So I don't care if it's one or two wide. As long as it's still single once they get to the top. But I don't like this. Just thinking about this because what they were doing is they would get here and then they would run here and then jump across. So I don't like that. So we're going to pick you up. Let's actually break that out. Break that and break this out. 1400. We're doing okay time-wise. We're going to end up doing just a couple more things and then we'll pretty much call it quits until the horde night and then i'll just meet you guys at horde night and we'll go through the horde should be okay i'm always a little bit nervous on horde night but the difficulty is not so high right now that it's dangerous i think we'll see what happens there we go oh, we got two layers here there we go. just gonna bust that one out let that one fall there we go because what i wasn't liking is that they were doing a secondary pathing there i really didn't like that then we can go ahead and upgrade everything on this front end. There we go. There we go. We don't really need to upgrade those, but it'll help a little. There we go. Get down here. Come on. Do it. There you go. I heard some footsteps. I'm not really sure. And then that will leave just like that because they, they end up pathing better if I leave that there. And then once I get close, I can pick them up. Okay, now we want to go. I still want this. I want the sledge here somewhere, right? Oh, 
man. Just the problem is I don't want to. What if we go like this? What if we go like that? Like that. And put it on the edge of that facing that way. I think that'll work. I hope. Like that. Like that. And then we need to get on the very edge. And place the sledge facing that way. Oh, hold on. We can actually do this. Let's go a little further back. Here we go. There we go. So we're not doing this balancing act. Let's get over just a little more. There we go. Like I want it right on the edge. And like that, like that. Okay. I should be able to pick up all these pieces. There you go. And that should be on that one. Yep. There you go. So that way, it'll basically, when they jump right here, they'll get hit by that and get knocked down there. I hope they don't get knocked. Oof. Hopefully they don't get knocked all the way to that. All right, last thing we're going to do is upgrade up here. I don't have a way to get up there, do I? I need to finish the upgrades up there, finish the upgrades below, and then we're going to go spikes and barbed wire everywhere. Okay, time to get our other people up there. This is going to be the hardest part. We're going to lead these guys, basically lead a, lead a horse to water. Hope they do their drink, but I don't know if they will. It's, it's so hard to get them placed in the exact right spot. But we're going to try to get them all lined up up here, so that way we'll have even more lines of sight. And we might even put a melee baker down there. Billy the baker. We'll put him over there. But you need to come with me. There's one. Here's two. Here's three. There you go. The three-man squad. Or the three... I'm sorry. The three-people squad. Let's go, peeps. This is going to be a little bit of fun trying to get them up there. But let's try to get them up there. And then we'll... Oh, man. Pretty much be ready. Now, the only thing I got left is barbed wire, but I want to get these guys. You're facing the wrong way, but I'm gonna, I have faith that you're going to turn the right way when it's time. All right. Oh, wow. That actually worked. Uh, I never know what to do when things work out the right way. You are in the wrong place, so you just stay there for now. Okay. Follow me. Come on. There you go. You're killing it. All right. Stand where I am standing. And then if we walk away, she'll hopefully go to the right spot. Yeah, there you go. Like I said, they're all facing the wrong way, but that'll hopefully get fixed when things start coming. Okay. And then last, you are going to be on this backside. You are going to be basically like our last line of defense over here. Making sure that we're safe on this side. I'll, I'll give you a little pedestal platform thing. There you go. Let's go ahead and upgrade it for her so she's not standing on frame. There we go. All right. I need you. Come here. I need you to stand where I am standing, and then I will get out the way. No, oh, we did it. Okay, cool. There you go. We got, we got coverage everywhere. We got two right here in the center doing our majority of our shooting right here, although I think they do break frames. That's why there's no corner piece there, because I think they actually break those out. Then that side, she's going to be shooting that way. If we could move you over just a little more, I think we'd be good to go. What if we go like this? Ready, stand where I'm standing, and then I get out the way. There you go. Okay, cool. Like I said, a, a little bit of an issue that, you know, the fact that they they don't have coverage right there, but that's okay. And then we got to get rid of this whole backside, but I am going to make it a little bit bigger back here, so I'm not going to fall off. Just so, just so the the anti TBF thing back here, so I don't fall off, right? Okay. And then this is all going to go away. We'll upgrade that. The very last thing we do. There we go. Very, very nice. All right, it's barbed wire time. Everybody's where they got to be other than Baker the Melee Man. Let's go back and get Baker the Melee Man. I'm going to make sure we have ammo for days. And I think that's it. Let's go ahead and start putting the barbed wire like crazy. Okay, we need extra rounds and weapons. Probably the last thing we'll get done. Let's take a shotgun. We haven't really done much shotgun stuff. I also didn't put any turrets up this time. I think we're going to be okay. That sounds like a mini horde. Crap. Not a good time. Hold on. We got hold on, the door is open. 
<laughs> That's not good. Yep, little mini horde time. Just a little wandering horde. Oh yeah, let's do it. Here we go. Any runners? I don't think we got any runners. Let's just get it done. All right, take these guys out. Okay, dude, hit the guy. All right, time to go through him. And that's why we're gonna increase the difficulty. We're kind of a big deal now. <laughs> Which means anytime I get really overconfident like that is when bad, bad things happen. Let me see what are the weapons we wanna take with us. One thing I know is no Molotovs. We've seen what the fire does. But other than that, we should grab most everything. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if explosives are a good idea at all just because of that. Uh, we will go, we got plenty of arrows just in case if we get down to that. I got plenty of shotgun on me now. We took some 44, some 5.7. We'll take some 5.56 five, if I have a weapon for that. I'll take a couple grenades even though I probably won't use them. And medical, just in case, we'll grab one of those, a couple of those. We got plenty of medical bandages. Good to go there. All right, and then last thing. Let's see, the other guns that we had. I think we have other guns, hold on. Maybe I don't. There we go. Other ranged weapons. Oh, I didn't even check if we have a better bow. 46. Ours is 53 with upgrades. This one's 50 with no upgrades. That's about to be the one. All right. Shotguns. We don't have a shotgun on us. So let's grab a shotgun. Lever action shotgun. 52. 50. 52. 70. Oof. M60. Uh, we'll compare this pistol. 55 with this pistol. Way lower. And, oh, the auto shotgun. Which one's better, the auto shotgun or the, we'll go with that one. And then a double barrel as a backup. Probably need to grab as many repair kits as we can. Let's see, repair kit, do we have any more extra repair kits in here? Not really. How many do I have on me? I've got, I've got a few. I think we'll be okay. All right, uh, time for the horde. Okay, it's about to start, man. Wow, man, we were, uh. Hoping to get a few more things ready. It's just not happening. But we'll try to hopefully survive this one out. Hopefully get through this one. And then on the next Horde night, the difficulty will be increased as well as the max total zombies. Actually, I think we're already maxed out total zombies. But let's see how this works. Hopefully they go where they're supposed to. Hopefully the pathing works. And hopefully no issues. What do we got? Oh, yeah. They're going right where they need to go. Perfect. Nice. And our hombres are going to go ahead and take them all out. This should be great. How are we doing? Oh, it's looking beautiful down there. Look at that. That barbed wire is amazing. All right, here we go. Horde night begins for real now. Get some nice pop shots in. There we go. That barbed wire is so good. All right, the barbed wire is incredible. <laughs> the barbed wire episode. Doing good things, man. Oh, no fire zombies. Hold on, kill the, kill the fire ones. I just don't want my base to start on fire. There you go. I really don't want those guys to light my base on fire. Alright, I think I can switch this real quick with... Where's grenades? I don't have very many grenades, but we can throw a couple. There you go. There we go. <laughs> Hopefully that, did, that probably destroys my actual barbed wire, doesn't it? There we go. I think it does. Oh, that's bad. And my base is on fire. Gosh dang it. That's something we were very, very worried about. Okay. Uh, yeah, if it all burns down, there's not much we can do. It's just pretty much going to die then. Hopefully the fire dissipates a little. There we go. The fire guys are an issue. There you go. There 
Jago just mowing down for that. I'm missing completely. Alright, they're finally getting up. Let's go get ready. Alright, this is going to be kind of the test what happens up here. There you go, you got rounds going everywhere. Good job, guys. Robot hasn't had to do anything yet. Shoot the fire guy. There you go. Doing good, man. What are you doing down there? Oh, no. Okay, repair this. Uh, repair. Yeah, they're getting knocked off there. Not all of them, but some of them. Alright, sweet. Let's do a little bit of shotgun action. Shot whoever got that one. Alright. Back in the go. Did she die? No. <laughs> Perfect. She gone. So far, so good. See how we're doing. You're doing good things, Baker. Don't look at me, man. Look at them. Alright, I don't know if I can grab that sledge or not. Just after midnight. Good little pistol action. I don't know where she's going. We haven't had any spiders get up here. There's the first spider coming. Good job. Level 146, man. We're rolling. Good job. 
Yeah, stay off the 762 for a little while. shot rifle by the way. <laughs> Could use the wrong one. There you go. Here we go. Oh, I got it. Repair the thing again. Can we repair this guy. got loot down there. Some of the loot's gonna disappear before we can get to it. Let's go back to the pistol for a minute. I don't know where he went. I think they're shooting it. Okay. I think it's getting shot by the nurse. I have a mission to kill lumberjacks. Come here. I 
Let me get one of them back here. Are you doing okay? We're definitely getting like weird spawns. Another lumber jump gun. Lumberjack challenge done. Got a lot of coins for that one. They do very much damage. Oh, that didn't work out. Did we get it in there? I did not. Oh, I missed that one too. Dang it. <laughs> they don't do very good anyway. Almost 4 a.m., guys. Next time we're putting Baker out there on the ledge, too. There you go, you made all the way to the thing. Good job. <laughs> My team is good, man. 4 a.m. Alright, did they all start walking or we got a couple runners? Alright, we're going down there. Oh, that's not good. I missed that one a lot. Okay, ow. There you go. Keep me safe, nurse. Right, a couple of random runners, but it's not bad. Got it. All right, last couple. Oh, you're not dead. And you somehow made it through there. We got friends inside. 
Okay. Ignore them for a minute. Let's go finish this out. See how they did on the front of this. We did okay. We got a lot of loot to grab. I'm going to start grabbing loot. Here, you guys can take care of the, the stragglers. Start looting like crazy. I think there's a couple of zombies below us is what I'm hearing. There we go. I think we got just about all the stragglers. We got a couple little random stuff here. The amount of loot on our inventory is absolutely awesome. There's still one zombie, and I can't figure out where. They're shooting at something. Where are you guys firing at? They're hitting her wherever she's at. Okay, she might be dead, dead finally. All right, guys, we're going to finish this out. Last, last bit of looting, and that's going to do it for today's episode. Got through the horde. You guys know next episode we move up to the next difficulty, which should be a lot of fun. Yeah, I don't know where she's at. She's like stuck inside of a block somewhere or something. I don't know. I keep hearing her like on random areas. Or maybe it was this lady. Was it you? It must have been you. But all right, yeah, they kept us super safe. That was a lot of fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to Fanny for making these servers possible. Huge shout out for checking this video out. Made it to the end of the video. You're my MVP and I appreciate you. Let's see. Let's bring it.